بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم آم یو چینل سائنس ٹیچر ٹوڈے مائن ٹاپک آف ڈسکشن اس اباؤٹ ڈرگز اینڈ دیر ایفیکٹس سو فرسٹ آف آل وٹ آر دا ڈرگز اینی کائنڈ آف میڈیسن وچ از یوز ٹو ٹریٹ دا ڈیزیز از کالڈ ڈرگ دا ڈرگس کڈ بی یوز ٹو ریلیو دا پین ٹو پروینٹ دا ڈیزیز اینڈ ٹو سیو دا لائف ٹو فائٹ اگینسٹ دا چمس سم ڈرگس آر یوز فار دا پروٹیکشن فرام دا ڈیزیز these kind of drugs are known as vaccine so the vaccines mainly produce antibodies in the body of the person and these antibodies protect our bodies from the many diseases and like the attack of many kind of the germs for example if a child is given the injection of measles vaccine so it means is or her body it has produced the antibodies against specific kind of measles virus so he will not get that measles after taking the vaccination of measles most probably so the drugs are what the drugs are taken against the brain mechanisms to fight or to maintain the brain or the body natural environments to fight against the different kind of situations to fight against the different kind of germs there could be the different reasons to take the drugs there could be the biological problem there could be the environmental problems that lead towards taking that kind of drugs so the drugs which are used according to the prescription of the doctor in a suitable amount for the treatment of specific disease that drugs are named as the medicines so these medicines are what these medicines which are taken according to the your prescription according to the statement of your doctor that are not harmful that are good to fight against a specific kind of disease many people think that it is unfor and unlawful the drugs which produce sleep like if you are not taking the drugs according to your uh, doctor prescription that definitely will lead towards a different kind of the other problems in fact there are the drugs which are harmful and dangerous for the user and it is also unlawful to keep them and to trade so that's why there is a proper definition for the medicines because the medicines are for medicines are for the treatment of the diseases almost all types either the lawful or the unlawful drugs are the dangerous to store up to the some extents but the people have to use the drugs to treat the diseases and to relieve the pain that disease that kind of the medicines which are used to relieve the pain that are known as the pain killer so those medicines which remove the headache or any kind of the pain they are known as pain killer like the aspirin and the paracetamol that are the common pain killers which are taken against the headache or some kind of pain those drugs which relieve pain promote sleep and produce the addiction that are not good and they are known as the narcotics which are addictive they relieve from the pain but they also promote the sleep which is not good and they also make that person addictive so the person cannot survive without taking that specific kind of narcotics for example the opium and the morphine these are those kind of the medicines or you can say the drugs which are known as the narcotics because they are addictive for the human so you must avoid them what are the effects of narcotics although the narcotics relieve from the pain but as they also have the harmful advantage and the unlawful drugs which cause addiction their danger in lies in the fact that these drugs produce addiction in the user and then he is unable to leave that specific kind of drugs his will power will end and at last he reaches that point where he neglect his official duties he will not be able to care about his families about his job about his life decision because definitely with the passage of time he will become weak mentally he will have the low will power the neglect his duties 
and he will indulge in the bad works to fulfill to uh, like to fulfill the demands of that addiction his self respect honor and dignity all are lost and he indulges in the theft and the, even the murder to get that addicted drugs the addiction of the drugs are of the following categories the drugs could be the sedatives and the halokinogens now what are that sedatives and the halokinogens these are the kind of diseases which are mainly the difference like the drugs which cause sedation for example the diazepam and the lorazepam first of all what are the sedatives and what how they work the diazepam is a kind of drug that is known as the sedative drugs and this is used for the short term treatment of the anxiety and the seizure disorders like they are also kind of they are as a type of narcotic so definitely they are not good so sedatives are the word sedatives are kind of drugs which produce the sleep like the addiction as the diazepam which is also producing the short term uh, like which is relieving from the short term time of anxiety that is not good and some common side effects of these sedative drugs are there like the headache the dry mouth the heartburn the decreased uh, libido the lack of the coordination the nausea the constipation and the drowsiness like you are always sad so these common side effects of that uh, sedative drugs are there same like that the halokinogens those drugs which disrupt the person brain to that extent that the person is unable to recognize the time place sound color and even the vision so mean it that means that he or she is not in his conscious like the cannabis Now, what are these cannabis? These are kind of the drugs which are very addictive, and they are mainly producing the. Uh, they are mainly disturbing the brain proper functioning. The person cannot identify the other peoples in that condition when he is taking this kind of the drugs, and he is like in the illusion state, having the double faces and the double structures and the places sound. He cannot recognize all these kind of places. because of the effect of these kind of specific drugs like the cannabis is there any question for you i hope you are clear about all these kind of the medicine and the narcotics which are not good as they are creating the addiction in the human so you must avoid them and you must have the medicine according to the prescription of your doctor thank you all office